Grocery bills may come down as stores resume their battle for your dollars. Consumer reporter John Mattery shows us some of the savings in his Don't Waste Your Money report. During the past two years, prices just went one way, up. But that's starting to change, and some reports say price wars could soon be coming back. Remember price wars when every store tried to offer lower prices than the competition? We haven't seen that since before the pandemic. But check this out. Aldi has just cut prices on 250 grocery items, saving shoppers $60 million, according to Bloomberg News. Aldi's message, Bloomberg says, is that price wars are coming back. It means Walmart and other retailers that promise low prices may have to cut some of their prices to match Aldi on items like cheese, chicken, and nutrition bars. And this may be just the first crack in the armor of rising prices as consumers finally close their wallets and refuse to pay more. And from the dust of that stink file, the upside and downside of price wars. The good, of course, is that shoppers will save money and that price hikes will have to slow. The bad, this is a sign of consumers retrenching, which often leads to a recession as consumers stop spending and then layoffs increase. Already Macy's and Target have reported slower sales this spring as three years of heavy pandemic spending come to a close. The inflation rate is now back down to 5%. And if price wars really get started, that could bring that number even lower. Now we don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris, ABC 27 News.